There are so many spinal health myths out there, too many to go through right now. So let's just start with three of them. Myth number one, spinal health doesn't matter if you don't have back pain. Now, this couldn't be further from the truth. Your spine is literally the backbone of your entire body. It's the foundation of strength and function for your entire body. It supports you, holds you upright, protects your nervous system, and allows you to move and function properly. So ignoring your spine is kind of like driving a car without regular maintenance on its engine. And just like you can't have a solid building without having a solid foundation, the same goes for your health. And the spine is the foundation of your strength and your health and your mobility. So myth number two, this is a big one. Your muscles determine your spine and posture. That's not true. You can't willpower your way to perfect posture or a strong spine. So to say just stand up straight and hold your shoulders back, although it's good advice, the problem is it's not sustainable for your brain and your nervous system to constantly be thinking about it over and over again. It's just not going to fix the posture and the structure. So now you may be wondering, okay, if and how you can correct your spinal structure, how do you get it strong and stable? There's no way. Well, that leads to myth number three, which is you can't correct your spine. Again, that's a myth. So when I was a kid with migraines and headaches, and even as I was going through college, I was told you can't correct the structure of your spine. You know, some people believe that with aging, that it's inevitable that their spine and posture is going to get worse, that hunchback, that uh, slouched posture. And then once it does, there's nothing you can do about it. Well, you actually can, unless you wait too long. But like I said, the muscles don't control your posture. So how do you correct it? The key to effective spinal correction lies in something called supportive or corrective traction. So traction is similar to putting braces on teeth to correct their position. So it's a method that targets, retrains, and molds the ligaments around your spine and holding your spine together and holds them in their strong, healthy position, thus restoring the proper structure of the curves and restoring the function. Here's something you don't know. Corrective traction has been around for years. It is specifically something called chiropractic biophysics or CBP for short. So even though it's one of the most scientifically validated techniques in chiropractic with over 300 peer-reviewed publications, not every chiropractor knows about it, not every therapist knows about it, therefore they don't do it. And if they don't do it and know it, you don't do it and know it. So in my next videos, I'm, I'm gonna be sharing more strong spine strategies. and we'll, we'll explore specific exercises, lifestyle adjustments, and corrective traction that can transform your spinal health and your strength. So make sure you keep watching these videos.